In this video, I'd like to cover the move out and cleaning guide. This, uh, this guide is meant to help tenants understand the standards which are to be met upon move out. You may clean the property yourself, but an, but an approved professional cleaning service is advised. If you wanna hire one of our approved vendors, please call and or see the attached list for contact information. So here's the guide first, you want to remove all furniture and personal property from the house, yard, and garage. Second, remove all trash from the house, the yard, and the garage. The trash barrels must be empty when the property is turned over. You cannot leave the trash barrels for pickup after you leave. A minimum $100 trash hauling fee will be charged if any trash is left behind on the property. Three, Clean all appliances thoroughly inside and out, including but not limited to the oven, the stove, the dishwasher, the microwave, especially the refrigerator and the washer and dryer. And um, section A, we wanna make sure both the stove and the refrigerator must be pulled out and cleaned on the top, the sides, the back and underlying the floor um, and wall behind and under the um, stove and refrigerator. Be careful not to tear any vinyl flooring, um, water lines, or scratch any hardwood flooring when pulling the appliance out. Just be careful. B, do not use harsh cleansers on the appliance surfaces. It could damage the finish. C, run the oven on the self-clean cycle, if available, and finish cleaning the interior after the cycle is done. D, clean the stove drip pans, replace them if necessary, and underneath the stove top. Use a non-abrasive pad and cleanser on ceramic and glass cooktops. E, clean the oven hood and vent filter. Wash the metal screens in the dishwasher or replace them. The inside of the hood must be thoroughly cleaned. Be sure to clean around the edges of the dishwasher, stove, and microwave inside the door. F. Garbage disposals must be clean of debris. G. All hard water stains and crust are to be removed from faucets, refrigerator, and water dispensers and sinks, showers, and tubs. This can take quite a while. H, unplug the refrigerator and thoroughly clean the entire interior of the refrigerator. This may require the removal of shelving in order to do it properly. Please do not leave the refrigerator unplugged. I, wipe out all drawers and remove any liners. Wipe down all shelves, the cabinet doors and drawers are to be wiped down with a cleaner made for use on wood. Seven, replace, excuse me, J, replace any and all burned out light bulbs inside and outside the property. This includes light bulbs for the appliances. For example, the light bulbs in the refrigerator, the oven or microwave if they burned out. Also four, Number four, clean all bathrooms thoroughly. Use a disinfectant as necessary. A, clean around and behind the toilet and the toilet seat. All hard water marks and stains in the bowls must be cleaned and removed. Do not use automatic bowl cleaners that are left in the tank. B, clean and remove any mildew on the tile, shower, and tub. C, clean all glass and mirrors. D, clean all bathroom exhaust fans, light bulbs, and fixtures. E, remove all hard water stains from the showers, the faucets, shower doors, and the sinks. Five, a professional carpet cleaner is highly advised. Do not attempt to rent and clean carpets yourself. If the carpets are not in satisfactory condition, we will hire a carpet cleaner on behalf of you, and this fee will be deducted from your security deposit. So don't waste your time cleaning it yourself. 
hire a professional or get with us and you can use one of our vendors. Number six, if there is a fireplace and it has been used, the firebox must be free of ash and all unburned and burned debris. The firebox and mantle must be cleaned of all burned on smoke. Number seven, clean or dust all hor horizontal surfaces, including but not limited to the blinds, ceiling fans, light fixtures, built-in shelves, baseboards, tops of doors, tops of drywall niches, tops of cabinets, and anything else will, that will collect dust or dirt. This is most commonly over, this is actually the most commonly overlooked item. And then we have to send in a cleaner to do this. And then we have to charge you from your security deposit. Eight, all windows must be clean, both inside and out. The screens must be hosed down to remove the dust and the dirt. The window tracks must be thoroughly, thoroughly cleaned. A wet vac and cleaning spray with a brush works well for this. Number nine, all light switches, electrical outlets, and switch plates must be cleaned. Generally, a toothbrush works well for this purpose. If you're concerned about electrical shock, turn off the power at the electrical panel before doing the cleaning. 10. Clean and mop all ceramic tile using appropriate cleaners for tile. In addition, a final hot water rinse is required, otherwise the floors will remain sticky. 11. Clean all vinyl flooring. A final hot water rinse is mandatory. 12. Wash down all walls to remove fingerprints and stains. The 3M Magic Eraser Pads work very well for cleaning smudges and, and small stains on the paint surfaces. Number 13, wipe down all doors, including the front door. Wash door handles thoroughly. 14, please remove picture hangers and nails from the walls. Acceptable nails and monkey hooks, etc., would be no more than two to three per wall. Touchpoint does not allow mounting shelves, TVs, etc., without prior written approval. Number 15, sweep out the garage and remove any oil stains from the concrete in the garage and on the driveway. Also, remove stains from the concrete driveway, as mentioned. If you can't remove the stains, you will need to have the concrete power washed professionally. Number 16, clean all HVAC registers. Usually they can be vacuumed and wiped down. If they're very dirty, they have to be removed and cleaned. 17, replace all burned out light bulbs in the house, garage, and outside. If light bulbs are left unchanged or not working, we will replace them, but we will be charging you for the cost of the light bulb plus the installation. 18, replace the HVAC filter with a brand new one. So when we arrive, we do not want to find a filter that's partly used or looks like it's been in there for over a month. It must be a brand new filter. Number 19, all weeds must be pulled in the front, back, and side yards. Gravel must be raked to be free of debris. If you want to use one of our landscapers or yard crews, please reach out to us. We can refer a vendor to you. 20. Please be sure that all smoke detectors and carbon monoxide testers are present, that they're still in place, and that all the batteries are working. Most of these units have test buttons that you can press to make sure that they're working properly. If you don't change out the batteries and we find that a unit is not working, we will change the battery, but we will have to charge uh, that fee against your security deposit. So please take care of that before you move out. 21, if you are a pet owner, please be sure to review your pet addendum, which is part of your lease for requirements as part of your lease and what your responsibilities are. All receipts for all of the services as required are due at the time of move, move out. They can be emailed to support at touchpointpm 
www.thinkingmusicalmusicianthropod.com. Thanks so much.